Ready to take your leadership to the next level? Maybe it's time to evaluate how you think as you lead. Hey, it's Jones Laughlin. Welcome to Insights from the Jones Zone, where I give you a way to master your week in three minutes or less. In 1970, Robert Greenleaf established the phrase servant leadership. In oversimplified terms, it means uh, focusing on the needs of others, especially those on your team, before you consider your own. Now, servant leadership is not as much a, a strategy or a technique it is, as it is a way of behaving and thinking as you lead others. If you're trying to determine whether you're more of a selfish uh, leader or more have the mindset more of that of a servant leader, here are three questions for you. First, do you listen to respond or listen to understand? Are you fully present in the moment, listening to what that person is saying, uh, thinking about what perspective they're bringing to their, their comments? Uh, are, you, are you sensing the emotions that are behind what they're saying? Uh, and are you understanding the context? Uh, or are you so focused on just what you want to say in response to them? Secondly, are you self-absorbed or are you self-aware? Uh, do you understand your own strengths and weaknesses as a leader? Do you reflect on how your leadership style impacts your team and, and those with different personalities and how it's important to, to adjust those as necessary to have that great conversation, to work more effectively with those people on your team? And finally, are you focused more on your own growth or the growth of others on your team? Uh, building capacity in today's teams is critical. Being able to make sure every person on your team has the, the resources and the training that they need to do their job well is immensely important. Uh, I think Jack Welch said it best when he said, uh, before you become a leader, success is all about growing yourself. When you become a leader, success is all about growing others. I hope it's a fantastic week for you. Thanks for spending a few minutes with me today in the Jones Zone.